Okay, hello my fellow brand armians. That's what I'm gonna call you guys from now on. Um, yes, I know I look really rough right now because of this outfit, but I'm finally back home from the fashion show, Miami Swim Week, and I am going to now finish the most awaited promising haul from Zara. As you can see, it's very big. I did actually do some of the haul though at the hotel and I didn't get to finish it there. So I'm gonna finish it now. So let's just start off from where we left off. All right, let's go. Okay, so this is the first outfit back from, you know, continuing from the other haul. I will, the same haul, but from Miami. Um, so this is a very classy outfit, as you can tell. Um, I think the skirt is just a teensy bit big for me. Not even in length wise, I think just around my waist it's a little bit baggy um it would be better if it was maybe like this you know even this length is pretty appropriate and nice and it is shorts so they look like shorts from the back but like a pleated skirt in the front and i don't know i just don't think this outfit fits me um i think my mom got a lot of the sizing wrong so hopefully the next few outfits will be better than this let's go on to the next Okay, so the next outfit here is a pink jumpsuit that literally looks like a hospital set, honestly. I feel like this looks like what you wear at the hospital, either as a doctor or a nurse or as a patient. I don't know, maybe for a baby shower. This just does not look very stylish. It just looks like appropriate which that's nice I, I think I like that and I like the color it just looks like so like a hospital thing I don't know why I'm getting hospital vibes from this and like baby shower like newborn baby I just delivered the baby like stuff like that especially with this headband too it's like I don't know it's giving me all of those vibes but I do like it it's a little bit small um not as big or as baggy as I would want it to be. I kind of like my hoodies to be bigger than my body, um, but this I guess will do. It could always be cropped to under a bra, something like that. Let me know what you guys think. On to the next outfit, of course. So the next outfit is this string maxi dress i like to say it's a maxi dress because it's not a mini dress it's a maxi dress it goes all the way down to my thighs of course i could put it up like this and fold it and maybe people would like it better like this because it's just shorter and it looks better like this the other way looks a little bit corny um i just don't know why that's what comes to the person's mind when they see it that long and it's not doesn't look good. There are dresses that are long that do look good. Unfortunately, this one is just not one of those. This is just one that is made to be shorter and it is what it is. Like it or not, that's what looks better. Like just state the facts. I am just stating the facts. That does not look as good as the other way. I don't think. And I don't think anybody else would think otherwise. On to the next outfit. Okay, so this is the next top from Zara. Obviously, the shorts are not from Zara. They are my shorts. Um, oh! But it is see-through, so let me put on a bra. Okay, guys. So this is the next dress outfit type thing. Um, this one's given a little insane asylum. I just love it though. I just kind of love it. I love the fake invisible pockets. Uh, that's super nice. I love the length and I love, actually the thing that I love the most is probably this up here. This just really pulls it all together. A lot of spice in the back, you know? Lots of spice. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I like this though. I, I really do. And you can always like trim it and it still looks super classy and super cute. I like it with the black pair of black stilettos. 
and this headband pulls it all together, honestly. What do you guys rate this? Let me know. Do you like it? Do we hate it? What do you, what do you think? Okay, this is the next outfit. I don't like this one at all. In fact, I actually like the other outfit, the Insane Asylum one better than this any day. This is just so like ghetto. I just don't like it. It looks bad. And I just don't think you guys are gonna like this either. I don't know what's going on. Maybe I should have taken off the shorts. I just still don't think it will look good. I don't like this biker short vibe. It just doesn't look good, especially on skinny legs. It just doesn't. <laughs> so I don't really remember if I showed this top with the other skirt, the beige skirt, but if I did not, here is this color top with this skirt. I actually don't mind this outfit too much. I think it's very cute. I think it's very appropriate. I don't think it's like, oh my gosh, she's a hoe. Oh my gosh, she doesn't know how to dress. I think it's just like perfect. Like, I think it's like cute, like good for a picnic, good if we're like going out to eat, something like that. I could always roll it up and then do a hoodie over and then it would be like never mind <laughs> yeah that that one rolled up once is okay we won't do it twice but yeah what do you guys think and i think this top is such a nice cool tone that definitely would match and go good with mostly anything it pair up pretty well and i also think that it goes good with anything on its own i think i just said that and I can make this skirt low rise too. Though it's supposed to be high waisted, so actually, no. <laughs> On to the next outfit. So of course there was another skirt, <laughs> similar to the other one with a little bit of a different design and a different color, pink. Um, I still think it goes with this top. I didn't really find any other top that would probably match well with this skirt, at least not yet. I mean, this hat could definitely be added on to everything. I think it's starting to not match at that point, though, so I think we should just take a little chill pill on the accessorizing part area. Um, this is the back. What do you guys think? I like it. I like it a lot. And I don't think this outfit is too, too cringe, too ugly. I actually really like it and I respect it, so yeah. On to the next outfit. So I did find this hoodie in the bag. I don't know if my mom is trying to be a jokester. Is she trying to joke with me? Like, does she think I'm like an 11 year old that's obsessed with this show? Cause that's not it. <laughs> I do like the hoodie though. I do like it. Um, there is Jenna Ortega on my, my shirt right now, right? Yeah, I think it is. What does her coffee say on there? I wonder if that's really the coffee shop in the show. So I do have an idea for this outfit. I could do braids, like literally replicate what's on my shirt, but then wear a black skirt and like some thigh highs. And I think it would be cute. I just think people are going to think that I'm like a 12 year old girl when I'm really 16 turning 17. So that's kind of embarrassing, but not really. I mean, it all depends. Growing up is a really big thing and you gotta make those transitions dude you can't be like still acting 12 you can't when you're 17 you can't be acting like just act your age you know what i mean do the things that your age would do probably okay so this is the next outfit um it's a skirt and a, and a gray top actually the other one was white this might be white and i'm just like thinking that it's gray i think it's gray i don't think it's white i think it's like a lightish gray color but I paired it up with this skirt I don't it, it, these skirts are not my fave honestly I think that they're a little too high-waisted and I think they could be better in so many different ways it's just something that doesn't catch my eye at least it's a skirt. at least it has shorts under on to the next look at this she got me the same skirt but a size 12 on purpose, you guys. She wanted me to, I guess she wanted me to see if I would be able to fit into this tiny ass skirt. 
and clearly I don't. It's like so tight. Can you tell? You can tell. Okay, so these shorts are not that bad. They're they're cute. It's like a safari type girl type short look vibe, I guess. It definitely goes well with the top, of course. It's a basic top. It's going to go with anything. Um, and the shorts are a pretty color, so I don't hate these shorts. Um, I think I don't like the top with it. Maybe if I had a different top, I would think higher of these, but I just don't. <sighs> I don't know why. Maybe it's because they're not low-rise. I'm so used to wearing low-rise things. It's just like any time I wear high-waisted, it's just unusual to my eye. It's not, it's not used to it. Does my hair make a difference? I don't know. <laughs> Let's go into the next outfit. Guys, this whole outfit is a mess. So this was supposed to tie here. It's just became a mess. If the zipper broke, the tie came off. It's just like a mess. And they're probably not gonna allow us, I hope they allow us to return it. Cause that zipper was already broken. Yeah, this is like, I don't know, fail this one. This is a fail. So I just wanted to hurry up and switch up the top for you guys because it was getting kind of like, come on, like, where is another top? But my mom barely got any tops. She got mostly like pants and dresses. So I have to, like, these don't really match all together, none of these, but this is so weird. This is such a weird outfit. It's so unusual. Like, you just wouldn't see somebody wearing this. And if you did, you probably think that there's something wrong with them. So I don't know. It looks like a hula hula skirt. Yeah, that's what it looks like to me. All right, on to the next outfit. Okay, so this is the next outfit. I don't hate it. I picked these two articles of clothing because I genuinely and generally thought that these two would go the best together. Whenever I do these hauls, I take whatever either my mom bought or what I bought. Usually when I buy it, I pre-plan the outfits in my head. But if she buys it, then I kind of go through everything and pick out these separate articles of clothing and then put them together in my mind and kind of try to match what would look best with each other, what go would go best together. Um, so that's why most of the time, that's why I was wearing that shirt for so long because it was like that shirt was going to go with mostly everything. And um, I couldn't really find anything else in these bags that would go with those so other articles so these two definitely go together um obviously because it's giving the fourth of july um red and blue and white america um and i have a black headband so whatever um but yeah i actually like this outfit a lot i think it's very goofy i think it's funny i think like a dad would be seen wearing this loki in his own style um i like it a lot i do like this outfit a lot and i think that it's not the worst one it's actually pretty high up there in ranking so yeah on to the next outfit all of these skirts or supposed to be skirt imitations are really nice because they have built-in shorts you don't find that like on amazon like if you're going to order a skirt from amazon you have to make sure that it has built-in shorts because most of the time it probably won't if it's like a really skimpy skirt uh, if it's a skirt like this, it probably, <laughs> God bless me, it probably will, thank you, if you said bless you, it probably will have shorts. I'm just saying, for reference, this is a really nice touch to have is the shorts under, um, but I'm finding that a lot of these skirts or skirts are kind of tight on me. I think my mom went shopping in the wrong section. So, obviously, um... Probably the beige top would go better, better with this, but I'm not gonna take this off. I just wanted to switch it up and see if something else will look good with this. It doesn't really match. Um, it, it as an individual skirt, I don't know. It looks kind of stupid right here. It should be like over there, closed up. I don't know what they were thinking. I don't know who designed stuff for Zara. They do have a lot of nice clothes, and then there's always like a, a hit or a miss with one of them. So, yeah, on to the next article of clothing. 
Okay, so here is the next dress. I know everyone's gonna say if I would just remove the panties, it would look good because of the panty line being there. There, I brought it down on this side. I'll bring it down here too. I'm wearing like boxer panties, so it kind of goes up when I put on a dress. But this is a really nice dress, I think. It has some stripes. It's kind of long, but it's good in length, appropriate for like a lunch or something. Um, I like it, I think it's cute. If we wanted it shorter, it looks like this. I kind of like it better like this. I don't know why everything just looks better shorter. I don't know why. Maybe because you can see more of the human body that looks beautiful without anything. <laughs> But yeah, guys, I think this looks great. I actually like this dress a lot. I think it might be one of the best pieces. Ranked up pretty high. And yeah, if you guys like it, let me know. I like it a lot. It's definitely a 10 out of 10 for me if it was this length. But it's this length and it's like a 9 out of 10 now. So yeah, let's go to the next outfit. Okay, so this is like a little artsy romper if you ask me. This is like something my art teacher would have worn. She was always wearing like a romper like this or like jean overalls and then like a white shirt under cause she would just like have the paint brushes in her pocket and just like take it out and be rubbing that paint all over her. But it has these ties in the bunk, but that's like about it. That's like all it does for me. So I'm not gonna even tie it to where it's like not gonna undo itself. So or untie itself. But yeah, guys, I think the color's nice. Oh, it kind of looks good like that, but it's gonna literally fall down. Like. So yeah, you guys, let's go to the next outfit. So I don't know about this. It looks very cute, I guess. I don't know what my mom was trying to make me look like. Like she didn't know if she was trying to make me look like an art teacher, a scientist, what was the other one? A person who delivers babies a nurse whatever like she just went through every career job that you could pick as outfit wise or if I add the hat I become like a New Yorker or some shit like that somebody from Italy a Parisian whatever the people from Paris I forgot Parisians I honestly don't know what the hell they call those people but I like it it's very stereotypical, that's for sure. I could add these shoes with it. Hold on, these heels. She got these like, these heels are for like a, a heels class. Which if you don't know what that is, that's like a dance class, but you are wearing heels. Like that is so stereotypical, oh my gosh. These don't wear, these don't really match, and they seem too small. I don't know why they just seem very small on me. I tried them on at the store. Or I look like a detective, like an old detective, like how they used to dress. Or somebody from Rick and Morty, that they wear these like coats, science coats. Somebody that walks in the rain, like so many different things. Oh my gosh. A detective, scientist, or a doctor that wears a white coat okay now she's trying to make me look like a doctor because the doctors wear the blue so it was a baby nurse deliver whatever art teacher art person whatever artist um what was the other one yeah a detective something like that scientist I don't know, you guys. These just look so funny. They're so wrinkly. I love it. Oh my gosh. I kind of like this. Like, let me get my little bag and, like, skedaddle through the city right now. This is, like, definitely the vibe of that. I like it, guys. Nobody's coming up to me in this outfit. They're not going to fuck with me in this outfit. So I'm keeping it. I like it, you guys. I really like it. Let me know if you like it. And we're on to the last final outfit. Let's go. One moment with the hat. Oh. Do we like? Do we like? 
Our room, matey. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You like my thigh? You like the slit? So this is the last and final outfit. I actually saved it uh, for the last outfit because I felt like this would be the one that you guys like the most, even though that might not be the case. So you gotta let me know which one you like the most. Um, also, red is the most liked color to the eye. Um, it's just people's like, it's the most attractive color. It might not be everyone's favorite color, but they are the most attracted to it. And also, um, it just played out that way. Like I was looking at the pieces of clothing that were in the bag and I was like, these two are gonna go well together. They're both red. This is a bodysuit mesh and this is a nice cargo skirt, red cargo skirt. So this is how it played out. And yeah, let me know if you guys like this. This is the last outfit of the Zara haul. I think I have like one more shirt and I'll just show you that guys for the fun of it. But yeah, you guys, this is it. Let me know which one you like the most and let me know if you like this one. Did I uh, predict your likings correctly? Okay guys, so this is the last top. Uh, don't really, I don't know, do you guys like it? I like it, it's simple. It goes with anything really. Some of this stuff was very simple. Some of this stuff was very interesting and bold and like no other different, um, unique. But um, I don't know. I don't shop at Zara that much. This is like a first time for me. I mean, not the first time, but it's just like, I don't shop here. So I just don't really know too much about their clothes. Um, they're very different and they're very classy, I guess. And they're very appropriate and they cover you up. They're good cover ups. And if you want to look like a doctor, a nurse, a detective, a artist, like definitely go there. <laughs> Yeah, you guys, if you guys like this, definitely let me know. I'm going to be doing more YouTube hauls as well, maybe like a Forever 21, so stay tuned for those, and let me know where you guys want to see me shop at as well for here. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Bye.